Hey, what's going on, ladies and gents? Welcome back to another Genshin Impact video. I wanted to make a video about Yai Miko and if he works in a team with Xia. And I know a lot of you guys might have this question Does Xia work with Yai Miko? Does Yai Miko work with Xia? Today, we're going to be answering that in full. So, here are my Xia stats currently, and it doesn't look too bad. It could be better, but it's not too bad. We're using the Black Cliff Pole. We are using the two piece Veridescent and two piece of the Reminiscence. No constellations and talent at 10, 9, 9. So, very high investment on my Xiao and my Yai Miko, as you guys can see. It is pretty decent as well with the Oath Sworn Eye, just so I can get my ultimate back more often. However, since we are using her for a sub DPS, we can actually, you know, switch back to the Sith and we can have a better crit damage ratio here for us today. Uh, artifacts we are rolling with the emblem of Severed faith as this is the current best set they have for her currently and we're running six six and eight that's gonna be it so we're just just get straight into a team with them so previously you could have xiao with fischl and fischl was you know the sub dps you know deals a lot of damage through us but now since we want to try out you know yai miko yai miko is going to be our sub dps for today and hopefully she does get her energy back quickly because she's going to suffer a lot. Unless I have an Electro character on my team, which I will not. I'm going to run with my Zhongli as well as my Jean. This is the Xiao team, right? So we're going to run that for now. So let's see how they do in floor 12, chamber 1 of the Spiral Abyss. All right, here we go. So the rotation will be probably... I'm thinking we're going to go straight to Zhongli, use our E skill, get the tenacity off, and then go to Yamiko, use our sub DPS, use our burst, use our sub DPS, and then back to Xiao. Let's see how that works. Let's go ahead. Boom. We're going to use her thing. We're going to hit our normal attacks first so we can get rid of the resistance. We can burst. And then we can use this back one more time. And we can actually burst with Zhongli if we wanted to. And get the E back. And alright. Let's see if this works really well. I mean so far it's looking pretty good. Uh, we're not losing too much on like damage. Especially since we're using a lot of time out of the field right. You know to switch to Yaimiko. To use her burst. To use her E skills. But unfortunately uh, her E is gone. My Xiao is dead. I think I'm going to lose out on a lot of time on my Xiao world because of Yaimiko, which is a little bit unfortunate. But okay, let's try one more time here. We're just going to use the bursts straight away. And we missed one of those bursts because he did fly away. But I think it's fine for right now. All right, here we go. Let's see. I don't think the guys are construct, the turrets. So it's going to last there for a bit. All right, they're gone now. So, I mean, it lasts for a good amount, like 12 seconds, right? But it does go away after a while, which means you're going to have to go back to Yaimiko just to provide some of that, you know, sub DPS again. So, yeah. I mean, not too bad, I don't think. Uh, maybe someone else other than Zhongli should be in this team. I'm not quite sure if it's going to make that much of a difference. But, oh well. Now, the question is, is it better than having maybe a Raiden Shogun or maybe like Fischl, right? That's, that's what we're comparing it with. For right now, it doesn't look too bad, but I definitely think it takes a lot of the field time. So, maybe Fischl would still be better since it takes, you know, absolutely no field time. But it def definitely does less damage with Fischl, so I don't know. For now, it looks pretty okay. We're on track, I guess. Almost. <laughs> We're not quite on track, but we're pretty much there, I guess. And here we are. Just do some normals so we can get our, you know, amount of resistance down. Um, Zhao is suffering from, you know, just the energy. We're not getting any energy from, you know, Yaimiko especially. But we are definitely suffering on energy department. Obviously, Xiao does, you know, have energy problems. But that is beside the point, I think. And... It's almost past the 8 minute mark there. And, you know, typically you would want to stay above a minute in order for this to be a qualified good run. But yeah, it doesn't look like we're gonna get there today. Oof. Alright, dodge that. And we're gonna go off a little bit more here. Alright. Alright, that was a little bit slow because I'm not quite sure why it was so slow, especially because of the energy recharge from our Yai Miko. So what I'm considering here 
is maybe we can have Xiao, we can have Yai Miko, and maybe we can run maybe Sucrose. And after Sucrose, we can have instead of Zhongli, we would have uh, Diona. Diana could help with the heals and with the shield. So this might be okay. Let's try this out. Alright, here we go. You just insta Diona here. And then boom boom. We can use you. We could have used the eyes alt, but I think it's okay to save it there. Just so we can, you know, fix her rotations, get more damage out like that. Uh, especially because we want to use her E and then get out. But yeah. Alrighty, we can use this if we want to. And then Yai, 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 ultimate. And then we can use Yai again. He completely dodged her tags, which is unfortunate. But here we go anyway. And oh, we, we do get Xiao's ultimate here, which is nice. And we still have Yai's sub DPS going off in the background. And it's gone. <laughs> As I say that. But I guess it doesn't make m that much of a difference since this thing popped up. But yeah, I mean, it's, looks, it's looking okay so far. It doesn't look too bad. Um, definitely could be better. I 100% agree on that. But it doesn't look too bad so far, I guess. Here we go. Alright, now we are struggling. Now we're struggling a little bit to get some energy recharge to our Xiao. Or energy particles in general. But here we go. We get this up. We're not quite there yet. All right, there we are. We are now there. We can use you one more time. And we do have her ult. I think we should use it in this situation just so we can save up on time. And we can bring the ult back. Or the elemental skill back, rather. And use that. And we ult. Okay, I don't think we should, you know, lose on that much DPS if we ultimate here. So, there we go. There we go, come on! It's still very much... <laughs> We're still halfway only. So, yeah, I don't think this team works quite as well. But, uh... Yeah, I don't know about Yai, Mika, and Xiao. I think it's a little unfortunate. How about that? We have Xiao, we have Yai, Mika, we have Fischl, and we have Jean. This way we can get all of them some energy recharge. If this doesn't work, I'm afraid... I'm afraid Yai just doesn't work well with Xiao. Which is unfortunate, like I really do want it to work, but I guess it won't work in this situation. Alright, here we go. Off that. And boom! Okay. Riai Miku's stuff is still up, and Oz is gone, so that's something to consider, right? Here we go. And we can use this. We can use that. We can use that. Still need to get some energy particles. Oh, dodge that! Alright, we're good. <laughs> okay, our energy is much better. I do... I do see that. But I think we're still struggling a little bit. Especially because we, we you know, we have to get rid of uh, Gao's ultimate that early. Oh, we might miss on some DPS here. We do. But I think it's okay. Here we go. Not too bad currently. We're doing okay. We do need to get our ultimate as fast as possible here though. And I don't know if we can quite do that just yet. We do this as well. We use Yai's ult. We no! We lose out on some damage because of mistimings. And here we go anyway. And I don't think it's terrible ult. It it's definitely you can definitely work this maybe if you have better energy recharge rotations i don't know it is kind of copium like you would need much better teams for this i guess i'm already at 7 30 i don't think you can three star this when it's like this close so yeah i think it's a bust guys i don't know maybe if you guys have better xiao team suggestions let me know in the comment section down below i will make sure to read them and try it out myself but yeah that's gonna be it i think my verdict is that xiao does not work well with yai miko i know shocker but yeah that's gonna be it for me hopefully you guys did enjoy if you did consider liking the video subscribing to the channel as well i personally think that yai is a good character let me know in the comment section what you guys think of yai and what other teams you want me to try yai on so yeah thank you guys so much for watching